I'm just checking to see if the live stream is uh, is live. We're using a B Live uh, TV, so just give me one second, ladies and gentlemen. I think we're live and on air, and there we go. We're up and running. Um, hopefully, you can hear us now. Let me just turn the speed down because we're using B Live TV, uh, and uh, we've got the definition too high, so it's making the video uh, laggy. Give me one second. Let me just turn it down a fraction. That will give us a better speed. And there we go. So thanks, everybody, for joining. Uh, Alfie is uh, is standing uh, by. Uh, today sees the launch of Alfie Best uh, Property Growth uh, Business Growth Network. And it's quite a monumental day because uh, Alfie uh, and myself, we decided to create an online business network to bring business owners together. Uh, why? Uh, because there's so many challenges right now in the UK and around the world. But UK business owners and entrepreneurs are sometimes uh, – uh, at a loss end, especially uh, when it comes to facing adversity. Some of us are not used to facing adversity. Now, we can overcome the coronavirus, and what we're doing is launching a business network where three uh, days a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, we're going to be going live at different times, nine o'clock, six o'clock, and one o'clock, and giving you an opportunity to come together as an incredibly trusted business network under the Alfie Best Business Growth Network brand. Now, this is to help everybody to be able to overcome adversity, everybody to be able to connect and to be able to share and to be able to grow their businesses. Now, Alfie is going to come on in just one second. We can't uh, sit together uh, clearly because of social distancing, but he is here um, and waiting to come on. So if you're in business right now and you're at a slight uh, a, a loss end and your concern, which many of us are, um, you know, we believe that by coming together, by forming a network, really cost effective network, the price of just us operate in a managing cost for £10 a week. You've got an opportunity to join us three days a week. What we're going to do is we're going to have everybody live on Zoom. We're going to broadcast that live to Facebook. So we're going to give your business exposure. Now, we was going to create the network anyway because we've got a 100-seat, uh, an event room here at World Has World Has Wildcrest headquarters and Alfie Best Property Grove headquarters. But we now need to launch it online and virtually because people are working from home. The lockdown is going to go on for a bit longer and we need to be able to get all of us uh, ourselves into a position where we can grow, where we can move forward. Now, I think I'm stuttering a little bit on the video. Uh, if you can give me uh, 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 a bit of feedback, if we're okay, the video speed's okay because uh, we're using a new platform. So Alfie's just coming up the stairs now. He's going to jump in the seat. Essentially, any business owner, it doesn't matter whether you're in property or you're not in property, for just £10 a week, you'll be able to come online on Zoom three times a week as a group marketing, sales, photocopier, stationery. Um, it doesn't matter what you do, a gardener, landscaper, a caterer, whether you're in an import and export business, whether you're in manufacturing, we want to bring people together and we want to do it quickly. Our first live is Wednesday. I'm going to be marketing over the next few days about everybody registering and signing up. This is going to be incredible because if you think about it, we're stuck at home and we can't get to work. We can't get out. Our businesses are really struggling. So what we're doing is bringing some trusted people online that register with us. You'll come online. We'll network together about an hour and a half each day. We'll stay online as long as we need to. Uh, Mondays, we're going to be 9.30 in the morning. Uh, Wednesday, 6 p.m. and Fridays at 1 p.m. Once we're out of lockdown, the business network will continue. And we'll also invite you here uh, down to head office to continue in a live face-to-face -face environment. So we welcome you to be part of the Alfie Best uh, Business Growth Network. It is not limited to property businesses. If you are in business, if you are an entrepreneur and you are struggling right now and you want to connect with like-minded in individuals, this is going to be an incredible opportunity for you. For less than the price of a cigarette and less than the price of a daily meal, uh, a daily a ticket to the cinema, you've got an opportunity to get your business live and on air, to connect with like-minded individuals, to be part of the Al Alfie Best Circle, and together we can overcome the adversity. Together we can overcome the challenges uh, that many of us are facing. So Alfie is coming up the stairs now. He's going to jump in the saddle and explain to you in a little bit more depth why uh, the Business Growth Network has now been created and why it's been brought forward, why we want to bring people together. 
if you're at home right now, <coughs> you know, I broadcast this morning saying, get yourself a desk set up at home. Get yourself a desk set up in your garage. Get yourself something set up where you've got a reason to get up and go to work. Alfie is going to jump on the stage now, ladies and gentlemen. For those of you that don't know Alfie Best, he's the chairman of Wildcrest Parks, which is Europe's largest park home operator. He has a number of, of business interests uh, from property uh, to hotels to golf courses, um, over 13,000 residents here in the UK with business interests in Barbados, USA, UK, and Europe. He's listed in the Sunday Times, a rich list of one of the richest men in the UK, but essentially he wants to help business. I'm going to jump off stage. Alf is going to jump in and he's going to tell you a little bit more about the network and how it can help you. Over to you, LP. I hope everybody's having a fantastic afternoon on uh, our bank holiday weekend. Um, I've got to be honest with you. The way things are, I'm forgetting what day it is, though, to be honest. Something like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Sunday. I'm genuinely forgetting what uh, what day it is. Um, yes, no, we, we've launched the um, Alfie Best uh, Business Growth Network, and it's basically to bring a network of business people together, uh, people that are striving, and also uh, people that are failing. And we are all failing in some way, um, some more than others, and some are growing in this climate more than others. I know that might sound difficult uh, to comprehend, but uh, but it is a fact, and I think we've all got to grab that. We're in such different times, unprecedented times, that we never thought would actually happen in our lifetime, but they have. But look, we've got... Uh, a great way to move forward and we really have we've got to you know stop being rabbits in the headlights and uh, and look to what the positives are and how we can uh, bring those positives out of our business no matter what the situation is um, I'm not one for laying down and just uh, you know letting the freight train run over us you know we've got to find a way of being able to slow that freight train down and be able to get on board uh, for the ride. We know this is not going to be forever, but the one thing that is uh, sure as God made little apples is that uh, our whole world is going to change after this. You know, we are going to be, you know, using social distancing even more when this is over because it's going to be ingrained in our mind what's happened because we never dreamed within our lifetime something like this would happen. So how can, and I'll use a, a wide uh, variety how can we help uh, get our businesses fully functioning if they've been brought to a complete standstill mostly by the epidemic but also by the shutdown that we have well we've got to look at the businesses that are thriving and what they need now I've been you know inundated I've had 470 odd messages and questions over social media for people that you know are asking me questions, I just cannot physically reply to everybody. It's not physically possible. So that's why we've set up the Business Growth Network. We're going to be doing this three days uh, a week, remotely, um, adhering to all of the social distancing, working from home, wherever is possible, unless it's an emergency to come to the office. reason that we're working from the office today is because this is payment day. And unfortunately, there'd be a lot of people not getting paid if I didn't come in. So we are working solely and adhering to what the government guidelines are. And that, that's quite important. Um, and look, none of us are perfect. We all break those guidelines. Nobody's saying we're, we're in prison. But what we have to do is adhere to them as much as physically possible. Um, and I've uh, and there's loads of us are going to get criticised for not adhering to them. But, you know, we are... We are here to live and we're not in prison. You know, we have to make our businesses work. We have to survive. You know, Wild Crest employs across the country 450 odd people. You know, um, we've kept, I would believe, 80% uh, of those people fully working from home at this moment in time and the others that we have furloughed. Um, but we've made sure that we've kept all of our um suppliers paid and up to date 
and we're making sure that we're in communication with everybody that we work within our industry. And we run many other businesses from, from here. Varun Motorhome Hire is one of our uh, businesses. It's uh, one of the UK's largest um, motorhome camper hire companies. Obviously, we run the Best Property Growth Academy. We also run uh, Kyoto um, Garden Furniture Import and Export. We also run Laurie Stone uh, PR, which is a public relations company. Uh, we have uh, another company called the Dorset Stone Quarry that we run from here. Also uh, a number of golf clubs, one mainly being the Sapi Golf and Country Club. Um, and on top of that, we also run Wildcrest. But what I would say, uh, some of the questions that I had was um, that their business has come to a, a, a complete standstill and they were restaurants. Uh, you know, how do you find a solution for that? Well, very simply, you know, we have to look for businesses that are working around the clock. And that restaurant, it may be a fine dining restaurant, but to actually keep physically afloat, sometimes you have to change your model. And for me, it would be pre-packed food that will be delivered to all of the areas that are still working and functioning. You know, it may not be the remit that you would actually do, but we have to find different ways. You know, there are many businesses that are carrying on, I would say to 80% of their norm, plumbers, drainage companies, electricians, because they're emergency type um, businesses. There's an awful lot of businesses out there that are still functioning, but they're just functioning differently. And we're all having to adapt. So by bringing a network of trusted people together, we can actually work our way through this and actually bring it together and work with each other. And this is not just about businesses that are trying to find their way out of the dark into the light. It's actually from the businesses that are in the light. And remember, it's feast or famine. Some businesses are just going round the clock. And I'm sure us that are in business have all, all had, you know, the people that are contacting us with uh, mountains of hand sanitizer or uh, masks and all of that is great and good and you know they're good businesses that are that are um working away uh, and we need as much as that as possible but i'm a great believer in do what you know work with what you've got even if you know it appears that it's become a lame business overnight because the lights have been switched off because the economy has just been changed for you that's not your fault that's like saying the airlines are a bad business because they've been grounded. That's nothing of the sort. Um, nobody could have foreseen what was going to happen. But together, we can find different solutions to help keep these businesses going. Because even though there is the furlough, we all know that we've got to bankroll that for the next six to eight weeks, maybe even longer. Who knows? You know, because the government have come up with these schemes. But the government don't wave a magic wand. They've done some great things, but for them to implement this is going to be very difficult. And as in business, what we've all got to watch out for is the fraudsters. Even more so, we have to be prevalent of that right now. You know, with the amount of emails that we're getting, um, offering so many different uh, uh, help in government grants that are above and beyond, 99% of it is fraud. We have to deal with trusted networks. And that's exactly why we're having the business growth network um, that we can actually bring people on board. And we will be vetting everybody. Everybody that comes on board, we want to vet them because we want to work together. We want their businesses to flourish. We want your business to flourish. I want my business to flourish. We're just finding different ways now of making this work. And look, I was criticised yesterday, believe it or not, for driving onto one of my own businesses to check how it was. And uh, I actually, uh, they sent an email out saying it was one rule for one and one rule for another. What they didn't realise was I was actually a mile down the road checking on my other business and then went on to that business to check that. Uh, you know, ludicrous, beyond belief. I was actually quite put out by it when there are people out there, good people out there, trying to keep the business, the businesses afloat. So there are a lot of people that have got jobs to go back to. I spoke to um, my bank manager 
And I said, uh, what would you say so far you've got people that are coming to you for help? And he said out of the SMEs, it's ranging around 30 to 35 percent of businesses that are coming for help to the bank. Now, that's now. That's now. So that tells you how severe it really is. You know, there are a lot of businesses that do run day to day on their cash flow, week to week, month to month. There are not a lot of businesses that have six months worth of funding. And that's how long this is going to take. And even when that six months is over, we are not going to be back to the normal. I, uh, my belief is we've got another two months of lockdown. I then believe that they will ease that lockdown, but they will stage it and they will do industry um, sections to go back to work and basically to test it and certain industries that they can send back to work. That's my belief. And then they'll stage that. So it's not just a free for all when they send everybody back to work. And I, I actually think if they do do that, it'll be the right thing to do. And I think they will also be bringing in social distancing until we manage to get on top of this and eradicate this so again i go back to this is about a trusted business growth network where we can help businesses work together to come out of the dark and see the light and the businesses that are in the light actually can be supported and supported in the way so they can make make the hay while the sun shines and making sure that their businesses are as profitable when we come out of this so that they have a, a trusted network to work with. For us as a business, um, we not only have uh, a lot of employees to look after and our team, and I just want to send a, a thank you to all of the Wildcrest and Varum and Kyoto Furniture and even at uh, Best Property Growth Academy and a number of other businesses. We've got Dorset Stone, um, Laurie PR, and all of the employees that we have uh, across the country. I would like to say thank you for the support that you've given the companies that you work for that are owned by us, and we will support you for as long as we can and as long as it takes, because we will find a way. My job is not in good times to take the glory, but to take the criticism in the bad times as well. And that's what I will do. But my teams will support me as they have been doing, and we will continue to support them as well. That's, that's, that's as simple as that. And it's very important that you keep your team um, within your businesses well evoked of what's going on. Everything within the business, because I think you'd be surprised. And I was... Um, pleasantly pleasantly surprised of the support that all of our teams have given us but i must confess really i wasn't that surprised because we got some great people it's not wouldn't be right of me to mention certain individuals that have gone above and beyond but no no, no I'm, I'm i'm a privileged person to have the team of people within our businesses that we've got that are working there whether that be uh, from the safety golf and country club down to Wildcrest, to the motorhome hire in Varun. Wouldn't matter. Um, going back to uh, another question that I had, which was uh, um, come through social media, and I would just say to you, I don't actually do my social media. It goes through uh, our social marketing manager, um, and then they'll send out responses to us, to me, uh, via email, because it's just not possible for me to answer every everyone that uh, messages in one of the questions was they've got um, a cleaning company which was uh, is now doing obviously very well but on the run-up to what they were um, foreseeing as a sale of their business to this pandemic they're now in a position where they can't sell the business which was a completely sideswipe question um, and what I said to them was, this definitely wasn't the time to be looking to sell your business, no matter how much your business has boomed. Um, what, the, what the right thing is to do, don't look to profiteer. Look to be loyal to the customers you have, 
gain customers you have and gain further contracts with good customers. So it's going to make your business stronger in the long term as opposed to making hay in the short term. That would make their business an awful lot more better to sell in maybe three or six months' time. Listen, I uh, thank you very, very much for your time. Going to hand you back to uh, uh, Bradley, and uh, I'll let you carry back on with your uh, social distancing, Brad. And thank you, everybody, for your time. So, everybody, thanks for watching. That's Alfie Best uh, once again. Need to give him a big round of applause because uh, it was 50 yesterday. He's had a birthday celebration last night, and actually, he's in the office. Uh, again today and grafting away. So really an opportunity for business owners to, to, to come together. So let me just recap what everybody's watching. So number one, Alfie Best Business Growth Network goes live on Wednesday as our first live broadcast. This is how it works. You register as a business owner. It's just £10 a week. Each week we're having three broadcasts, Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Mondays, we kick off 9.30 in the morning to get you pumped for your week. Wednesday, it's 6 p.m. at the end of the day. And Friday, it's 1 p.m. so we can still catch up with the weekend. Now, here's how it works. When you register, you get access to all free events. Now, you can be as active in our business network as you want or just turn up when you need to. Many people that register will find that they're going to become very active. They'll be speaking. We'll be broadcasting live via Zoom. So we will all be live on Zoom. Then we will broadcast that to Facebook. So your business, yourself, your brand is going to be marketed to Facebook. We'll then repost it to YouTube and to Instagram and to Twitter and anywhere that we can. You would also then start talking offline with the connections that you meet. We will come together and talk about business, business growth, entrepreneurship. We will refer business back and forth with each other. We will talk about best practice. Is. We will talk about the challenges that we face that Alfie says are not challenges, they're not problems, they are opportunities. We're going to lift you and ourselves in the process up and out of any negative mindset and into a positive position. We're going to network with each other, we're going to refer business, we're going to find ways to help each other um, overcome the challenge we're facing right now with coronavirus. <clears throat> we're going to survive, we're going to thrive, and we're going to grow. And together, we're going to create a band of brothers and sisters that will become trusted with each other, that will become happy to network. And once the lockdown is out of the way, we will invite you down here to uh, Alfie Best Property Growth headquarters where we have a 100-seat training center and we'll meet you in person. We were launching this anyway uh, as part of our events program, but when we stopped, when we had the social distancing, we had to stop. So we've adapted. Not only that, <clears throat> we also have other courses that we run. This one is specifically for business owners. It doesn't matter whether you're in the property sector or not. It's £10 a week. Cancel it any time. Come in for a week, have a test, network, and see the value that you're going to get in terms of motivation, inspiration, in terms of commercial knowledge, skills, and ability, in terms of how you can cross-pollinate, how you can cross-pollinate with other business owners, how you can meet new friends, come together, and build a network under the Alfie Best brand to become a trusted business network in the UK. And I'm absolutely certain that will be having broadcasts with different business owners. Some of you may say, look, Brad, Alfie, I'd love to do a podcast with you. I want to leverage my brand against Alfie Best or the Alfie Best Property Growth Brand. We also do do that. We do live broadcasts. We book in people. There is a fee for Alfie's time, but if you want that, you can have it. There's many other things you can have. But for now, for just £10 a week, <clears throat> which is less than you know uh, uh, some fuel or uh, a packet of cigarettes or a decent meal or a bottle of wine, we've got you three days a week week going live with us in zoom and live on air on facebook we want to give each and every one of you as much exposure as we can for your business you're not alone remember that and you're not down and you're not out you're just dented and any business owner that doesn't have scars doesn't have experience this new experience we're experiencing now there's nothing that's ever going to be the same again
we will never be the same again. We're always going to be wondering now about this virus and where it's going and how it's going to impact us. So let's come together. Let's get ready. Let's share ideas, best practices. Let's connect with each other. Let's make sure that we can help each other to grow. Now, I'm an experienced business coach and I've worked in so many business sectors. It's unbelievable. Alfie is a hugely successful multimillionaire. He's a man that's now known all over the world and he's prepared to give you time. Now, Alfie will come on one of these lives every single week, guaranteed. The rest I will run uh, with you. We will also look to the future to build Alfie Best Business Growth Networks in your area as well. But for now, let's do what we can virtually. Let's do what we can online. Let's do what we can to help each other grow. So for now, uh, I just want to say thank you for taking the time to watch. If you're a business owner right now and you'd like to join us, then the link is below. It's alfiebestpropertygrowth.com forward slash uh, business network and then you can register it's 10 pounds 10 pounds a week we kick off on wednesday night we'll also be having some of our existing clients and existing members of the property academy uh we do specific training for property on thursday nights this is for business owners anywhere in the UK. And in fact, if you're in another country, you'd like to join us, you can do. There's no limitation because we now trade on a global platform. We are now a global family and a global community. But we do believe that the UK can be made uh, we can make the UK great again. We can get manufacturing moving. We can utilize all of our skills. We can come together and, you know, like um like any army, the greater the number, the greater the power we can have for each other and with each other and the greater um, <clears throat> greater things we can achieve. And, you know, just to, to end you, you guys on this before we finish the broadcast, do you know sometimes you, you actually don't know where you're going? In life, you think you've arrived at a place in your business and something happens which you think is adversity. But forgive the saying, in some cases, it can actually be a, a godsend because it may be realized that maybe what you was doing what, what you is not what you're going to be doing and something can change and shift in your business. It may be that you're doing what you love already and you're finding ways to enhance that, to, to increase your network. And we've got to be prepared now to get ready and to get our thinking caps on, to get onto into our offices at home or uh, if you if you are going to work and and it's it's vital that you do then uh, understandably you know you'll need to go in but otherwise the rest of us we're social distancing we're at home we're isolated we're in our masks and if you are at home then let's get you online let's get you motivated because between us all we've got a shed load of skill and experience and ability to help each other and when you teach you learn. And when you help somebody, it makes you feel great because you may have a solution for somebody else's business and they may have a solution for you. So we've adapted. I've had to adapt. Alfie's had to adapt. Do you know, and Alfie, you know, is the, the dad uh, and the chairman of all of his companies. Can you imagine how many people he has to speak to every single day to keep everything moving forward within his various businesses? It, it, it's really, you know, it's unbelievable to think about the amount of calls he has to make to keep the operation moving. And he has got an exceptionally good team. Of course, but there's always a leader at the top of any business and you are that leader in your business. You're an entrepreneur. Entrepreneurs innovate, we motivate, we inspire. And from that, we build and start, start up companies, we build companies and we create employment opportunities. We create wealth. And again, it will be down to entrepreneurs to be thinking outside the box, to hold on to that resilience that they've got inside them and to save what they've got, to enhance what they've got, and to grow once more with the scars of the coronavirus that we survived it and we will coming out the other side stronger, fitter, faster, and then continue working on the commercial growth of our businesses. So, ladies and gentlemen, for everyone that's been joining and commenting, we thank you very much indeed on behalf of Alfie and myself. Of course, happy Easter Monday. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Alfie Best Business Growth Network for all businesses in the UK. It doesn't matter whether you're in property. Some of you guys will cross over. 
uh, into our property training. But this is Alfie Best Business Growth Network. It's £10 a week, three uh, live Zoom calls. Now, we've put up the website and the holding page, which is ready to go. Um, and on that website, you can register now. We'll update it as the day goes on. But we will be going live on Wednesday. Let me just see if I can put the a comment in the post <clears throat> uh, so that you've got that. Just bear with me. We're already getting messages uh, right now. Uh, let me just... Uh let me send a message in there for you guys. One second uh, with the link, which will go in there for you. Uh, there we go. One minute. It's just loading. And then, uh, guys, get registered. And we'll see you on Wednesday. Also, uh, people that are registering. Now, if you would like to physically talk on Wednesday night when we launch, when you register, Register your details, then DM me, not Alfie, because he's got too many things to, to do. A DM me, said, Bradley, I'd like to be one of the first speakers on the launch night. We'll give everybody that wants to speak five minutes, but ultimately we will have a group session. We'll be going for about an hour and a half up to two hours. And in that two hours, what we will be doing when we're live on air is we'll be hearing from different business owners. We'll be hearing of some of their challenges, which we're going to turn into opportunities for growth, survive, thrive, and grow. Survive thrive and grow and then what we're going to do is we're going to have breakout rooms as well where you can break out and you can network you're all going to swap numbers you're going to build an incredible trusted network underneath the Alfie best business growth brand once we're out of this lockdown period we're going to invite you down to Alfie best uh, head office we can hold up to 100 150 people on our training floor and we will all come together this is what businesses need right now we all need to be inspired we all need to be motivated now I'm going to be back at the desk uh, tomorrow morning. Our office here, Alfie's office at Wildcrest, is in total lockdown. Uh, normally, it's just Alfie sitting in his office. All the staff are furloughed at the moment, um, or myself coming in to broadcast from the stage. And we are distanced, and we are protected in terms of masks. But ladies and gentlemen, you are an entrepreneur, and you're an innovator, and you're a leader. By coming together, other people will inspire you. You will inspire others. We will lift the energy. We will lift our passions and our vibration. And as entrepreneurs, we will come through beyond and we will grow past coronavirus. But we must come together now. Welcome to Alvi Best Property uh, Growth, which is our business growth network. You don't have to be in property. You just have to be an entrepreneur. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. The link is there now. Register and do join us. The first live event is Wednesday at 6 p.m. Go to the website now and there's more there than we can put up today because we put it up today, but you'll get three broadcasts a week on Zoom, live to Facebook, post it out to YouTube, post it out to LinkedIn, Twitter, um, and to Instagram. And then we'll also have further broadcasts and opportunities to really give your business a spotlight. Some businesses have requested uh, direct coaching and mentoring uh, with Alfie and myself. We do direct coaching and mentoring, but let's get you into the £10 a week network. Let's get you in there, first of all, because it's cost effective and we've got to be sensitive about money right now. And then we can see where everything goes. But together we can grow. Have a fabulous Bank Holiday Monday. Thank you, everybody uh, that's commented. Thank you, everybody that's come online. Um, and there's too many names there uh, to mention, but let me just try and uh, swing through. Hey, Kevin James, Jimmy, Luke Grundy, thank you. I'm going to be calling you shortly, Luke. Uh, Pete Burns, thank you so much. Sitting at home uh, as a sitter. Um, and, and he's saying thanks. Uh, excellent advice. For Alfie, Harry Carvey, as always, on top form. Well done, Harry. Um, Colette Hunter, uh, well done, Colette. Thank you very much indeed. We appreciate that. And uh, a number of names there, which I can't see because I'm on uh, Be Live TV. So happy Easter, everybody. Uh, we look forward to seeing you on the network Wednesday night. This is now time for businesses and business owners to really start thinking about where we're at, where we can go. And this is it. Take care. God bless. I'll end the broadcast and we'll see you soon. Thank you.